In this video, we take a look at five reasons that make Arnold the best render engine for Cinema 4D. So what is the best render engine? In most cases and for most DCCs, there is no definitive answer. But in case of Cinema 4D, the answer is Arnold. And here are my top five reasons why. By the way, if you are interested in Arnold, make sure to check out our latest course here at MoGraph Plus, the ultimate introduction to Arnold 6 for Cinema 4D. It's a massive 12 hours course in which we explore all the aspects of Arnold for Cinema 4D thoroughly. Make sure to check it out. The link is in the description. Also, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. Now, let's get started. One, it delivers the most photorealistic renders. Among all the render engines available for Cinema 4D, renders that come out of Arnold feel and look the most realistic. They might take longer compared to Redshift, Octane or Corona, but due to the unbiased nature of Arnold and the way it handles light interactions, the final look Arnold delivers feels better and more real compared to anything else. Depending on your prerogative, you might prefer sacrificing a bit of realism for a faster render. For me, the final look is always the priority. 2. It's stable. In a production environment, big or small, you need to be able to throw any type of scene at your render engine and feel safe that it won't crash on you. And you can rely on Arnold to give you that stability every single time. When a render engine is synonymous with feature films, you bet it's because it is stable and reliable. And even if there is a bug in a new release, you can rest assured that the bug fix will be provided in a matter of few days. 3. It's feature packed. Arnold for Cinema 4D is the most feature packed render engine. GPU rendering, CPU rendering, full support for OCIO and specifically modern ACES color managed pipelines, the most powerful and comprehensive list of shaders and utilities and nodes for development of realistic materials. It supports open shading language, USD or universal syn description format, a must have for any modern pipeline, and the list goes on. You name it, Arnold has it. You really get everything you need for a hassle-free, extremely customizable, yet accessible and robust rendering experience. 4. It's user-friendly. One of the main reasons I'm hooked on Arnold for Cinema 4D and use it as my daily driver is how easy it is to use. Everything makes sense. Features are designed and implemented to enhance the user experience. The workflows are not convoluted. The render settings are simple and very easy to understand and master. Once you learn something in Arnold, it sticks with you. You can't forget it even if you tried. Because on a fundamental level, Arnold is built on this philosophy that the user time is more valuable than the computer time. So it might take a bit longer to render compared to something like Redshift, but it will take you less time getting there and hitting that final render button. And the render looks better anyways as I mentioned in the first point. 5. It has both CPU and GPU rendering. Considering Redshift and Octane as purely GPU based renderers and Corona as a fully CPU based renderer, Arnold is the only solution that gives you both CPU and GPU rendering at the same time. With a click of a button, you can change which version of the renderer you want to use, even though they implemented GPU rendering a bit late, as Arnold is historically a production proven CPU rendering solution, but they wanted to make sure you get the exact same result no matter which version you would use. So you can switch between CPU and GPU rendering and the final result would be the same. You get a one-to-one -one pixel perfect result. We know Vuri 5 for Cinema 4D is in the works and might be available in a few months and that would allow us to render with both GPU and CPU as well. We'll judge Vuri 5 for Cinema 4D when it comes out but they have a lot of making up to do. So those were my top five reasons why Arnold is the best render engine for Cinema 4D. Let me know what you think about the video and if I'm being fair or not. Also, what is your favorite render engine in Cinema 4D and why? Share your thoughts down below in the comments. Finally, make sure to visit our website mographplus.com or our Gumroad store at gumroad.com slash mographplus and check out our premium CGI and rendering courses for Cinema 4D, 3ds Max, Maya, Arnold, Corona, V-Ray, Redshift, Octane and so on. You can also subscribe to our email newsletter to be instantly notified when we release a new course. The link is in the description as well. Great! See you in the next video. Happy rendering.